हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल वेलकम टू द क्लास स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट अ न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज फिजिकल एंड केमिकल चेंजेस यू नो दैट चेंजेस अराउंड सच वी हैव मैनी सब्सटेंसेस अराउंड अस ऑल दीज सब्सटेंसेस दे हैव सर्टेन प्रॉपर्टीज सच एज स्टेट दैट आर सॉलिड लिक्विड और गैस साइज शेप्स कलर्स स्मेल टेम्परेचर कंपोजिशन एंड स्ट्रक्चर एट्सेट्रा वेन वन आर मोर प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ दिस सब्सटेंसेज बिकम डिफरेंट वी से दैट ए चेंज हैज़ टेकन प्लेस इन इट हेयर इज एन एग्जाम्पल वी नो दैट आइस मेल्ट टू फॉर्म द वाटर तो मेल्टिंग आइस इज कॉमन चेंज अराउंड एस नाउ आइस इज ए सॉलिड एंड वाटर इज ए लिक्विड सो दैट मेल्टिंग ऑफ आइस इट इन्वॉल्व ए चेंज इन स्टेट्स फ्रॉम सॉलिड टू लिक्विड एंड चेंज टेकिंग प्लेस ऑल अराउंड एस some of the changes observing by us in our daily life that is formation of curd cooking of food drying of cloths ripening of fruits and rusting of iron the changes substances does not occur on its own see here few external factors are there which are responsible for the changes now next one is types of changes you know there are different types of changes based on their occurrence speed reversibility reversibility etc and so let us learn more about the kind of changes around us so changes based on repetition to periodic and non periodic changes students you know that some changes which are occurred in seasons to so changes in season also takes place after a fixed intervals or time such kind of changes that repeat after a fixed interval of time that are called the periodic changes and second is non periodic changes which are not occurred at a certain interval of time now next one is so let us see here these changes like volcanic eruptions these are non periodic changes so changes based on time taken slow and fast changes few changes are they takes very long time that are called the slow changes and few changes they takes very short time that are called the fast changes now growth of a child into an adult it is a slow change and some other example of slow changes that are ripening of fruits germination of seeds curdling of milk boiling of the their blooming of flower and formation of fossil fuels etc and fast changes they takes very short time and these kind of changes takes place within few minutes or seconds like being blinking of eyes sneezing burning of matchsticks bursting of crackers lightning of electric bulbs bursting of an inflated balloon etc now changes based on reversibility and irreversibility you know that physical changes are reversible but chemical changes are irreversible here reversible changes the changes which can be reverse and the changes which cannot be reverse that are called the reverse irreversible changes so a change which can be reverse to form original substance that is called the reversible changes like blowing up bulb etc and in irreversible changes a changes which cannot be reversed to form original substances is called an irreversible changes now like tearing of paper here reversible and irreversible changes and thereafter desirable and undesirable changes so here some changes are beneficial to us where as some as harmful to us for example ripening of fruits is being changed so we try to make the ripening of fruit faster by artificial methods such kind of changes which are useful to us are called the desirable changes and that some other examples of such changes curdling of milk blooming of flower construction of buildings baking of cake etc that is desirable changes and on the other hand some changes are harmful to us these are called the undesirable changes like rusting of iron harmful changes as it damage the iron objects so we try to prevent the rusting from the by the galvanization by painting etc earthquake floods spoil 
here spoilage of food and population of environment these all are the undesirable changes so here when you will study changes based on repetition that are called the periodic changes and the changes which are here changes based on usefulness that is desirable changes and reversible changes and which takes their original position after change and change based on time taken that are slow or fast changes students it's sufficient for today the remaining portion of this chapter we will discuss in our next video till then thank you thank you everyone